The U.S. men's national team officially advanced to the CONCACAF Nations League semifinals and booked a place in next summer's Copa America 2024, although it's hard to qualify Monday's road performance as a morale win. Serginho Dest's shocking first half-red card made life difficult for Greg Berhalter and his side, who squandered a lead to drop the second leg of their quarterfinal fixture against Trinidad and Tobago 2-1 advancing thanks to the 4-2 aggregate scoreline. Turner didn't cover himself in glory on either of the Soka Warriors' goals. On the first, he was beaten at the near post after seeming to lose his footing. On the second, he got both hands onto a free kick from Alvin Jones, and while it was a well-struck shot, it's a save that a player of his caliber should make every time. Robinson got the Yanks off to seemingly a perfect start. Burying a cross from Serginho Dest with a gorgeous diving header for his second goal in as many games. After Dest sending off, he continued to be a bright spot, working hard on both sides of the ball to try and salvage a result. Bream was typically calm in possession and assured defensively. He generally dealt well with Trinidad's attack, especially as the night went on. Could he have intervened more strongly to pull Dest away from the referee? The Celtic defender could perhaps have been stronger in holding off Rian Moore for Trinidad's opener after allowing the striker to get in behind. Overall, he was solid against a physical frontline, but his distribution left something to be desired. Stopped all the US momentum with a needless sending off. Not only did he launch a ball into the stands in frustration over a perceived missed call, but he continued to berate the referee after that, earning two yellow cards just seconds apart and drawing the visible ire of his teammates. De La Torre put in a shift in his 90 minutes on the field. The Celta Vigo man had to work even harder after the sending off, covering every blade of grass on the field while maintaining a high level on the ball. Musa pulled the strings in midfield for the U.S. before the sending off and tried to maintain their approach in the second half. He was typically composed on the ball, but more importantly, he showed up several times with crucial recoveries to win back possession and keep Trinidad's lead from increasing. Reyna was bright in his 42-minute shift, creating a couple of chances and finding intriguing pockets of space. He was the immediate victim of Dest's red card, hauled off before half-time to adjust for playing a man down. It wasn't a banner night for the Monaco attacker. Balogun's effectiveness waned once Dest was sent off, and the deeper he dropped to get on the ball, the less effective he became. He did have a half-chance in the first half to double the U.S. advantage, but he scuffed his shot and sent it well wide. Pulled off after 64 minutes as the U.S. changed shape again to adjust to the red card. 